we're playing Minecraft after a really long time. So yeah, it's been like one year or so, and I don't know what I've been doing. But anyways, we're back on it. We're making a beginner house you can make in survival. I'm doing it in creative to make things a little easier, but of course you can make in survival. Using birch planks to make the base of it. I'm playing in my iPad Pocket Edition um, 1.19, which is the latest release, the wild update. And I really like it, you know, it has alleys and stuff, so I think you should try it if you have not. So just trying to quickly finish it up. Uh, use any planks. I've just cut down birch trees as you can see in the front. That's what it looks like. And well, when you first get them, they're logs, but you just have to turn them into planks. Now I'm making birch doors and putting them right there. Now you have to use glass panes to put around the house. Uh, just one layer, not two. You can uh, color the glass if you like, and if you don't know how the glass is made, well, you have to collect some sand and put it in a furnace. And then you get glass blocks. Alright, now we're just adding another layer of the planks. Again, this is up to you, whatever you want to customize or do whatever you want with it. This is just my preference. And guys, if you are wondering, then I am going to be posting a lot more tutorials about Minecraft. Not such like vlogs or videos like that. But yeah, like tutorials to, you know, and a little bit of recipes about. Now, you just want to finish up the plank, another layer of it. And I'm going to put it over the door as well. And now it's getting really dark. I bet spiders are gonna come up the roof, but yeah. Alright, now I'm using slab, the same wood, and I'm going to use it as the base of the roof. You can decorate it or whatever. Now I just wanna cover it up all the way. You can use a spot for chimney if you like. Alright, now we're going to be using stairs to put around the roof. And you can use it as furniture as well, but it's like, it creates a nice village type of house, roof, whatever. Uh, yeah, there's a tree right there, so I, I'm probably going to chop it down because it's really annoying. And it's getting in the way. So just quickly chop it down. There's a creeper in front. And I just bumped into a cave. Anyway. Just finish the whole tree. I haven't set the tick speed too, like, too high because I don't really know. But, okay. It's gonna take a while to, like, you know, finish up the leaves and everything. I forgot a little bit of the wood there. Alright, now that's just gonna do its thing, and we can move on doing our thing, making the house. Okay, there's a zombie right there, but anyways, we're gonna finish it up. Oops. Okay. Okay, the last staircase, and there's spiders trying to come. No matter how big house I make, they always climb up there. Like that spider over there. Okay, now I'm just using another slab. Oh dear. Okay. The spider is just gonna come in way. So I'm gonna kill it. Or get it out of the way. Just cover the whole bottom thing with the slab. This spider will just not let go. Will it? Okay. Just gonna get it out. There we go. Now we're just gonna add another coverage of the slab. If you've ever been to villages, it's quite easy to find them. I just love their houses and like it's so small. It's so small and I just love the roofs they make, but anyways. Okay. He's just dancing up there, 
Now, let's check out what's going on. Two zombies. Okay. Trying to break in the door. Kill them. Look at that. I just got that axe to finish it up a little quicker. So you guys don't have to wait until I kill it. I probably don't think you'll want to see that. Alright, coming in and closing the door so no mods enter. Now we're just gonna add lanterns after, you know, finishing up all the grass and flowers. But first, we're wait a second. Okay, okay. Alright. And I just did a mistake. I have to add the planks first. So we're gonna break the lanterns. And we're gonna add planks underneath them. Oh, uh, the whole floor. Right now I'm just doing the lantern bits so that the lanterns are done first, but you wanna do the whole floor. All right. And, okay. We're done with the uh, floor. Now we're gonna use light gray carpet, any color you like, and we're gonna put it in front of the door as well as the whole you know, four. Instead of the lanterns, we're not going to put it under the lanterns. Okay, because if you didn't know, you can't put something on top of carpets. It will just be a kind of, you know, a gap. There will still be a gap. Now I'm using red carpet to add a little, you know, design, decorate a little. And I've seen that this is daytime now, so nice to finish up the house. Now, I think we're going to add a little bit of, you know, furnaces and crafting table to get this started. And blast furnace. And I think I'll cover it up with the red carpet as well. Okay. Now that that's done, we let's take a look outside. I think we're going to add a little bit of border around the house with planks so you just like a little border and this does take a little time you know if you're in survival you'll probably need a shovel to do it that's why to make this video a little quicker I chose creative to do it flowers are really in the way I hate when flowers are in the way Okay, okay, okay. Quick. And almost done. Okay, guys, so now we're going to end the video right here because the story base is done. If you want to see more, stay tuned, turn on the notification bell, and yeah, so we're just going to end the video. Hope you liked it. And I'm just creating a little bit of space, but we're just ending the video right here, honestly. So, yeah like this video, share and subscribe. See you later. Goodbye.